What is that you like about club? Um, what I like about club is that I get to learn about God and all the different things. And I get to learn Who's your favorite teacher? Um, all of them. Jesus never sinned, but I have. Jesus never sinned, but I have. Jesus never sinned, but I have. I copy it with my hands. I really uh, enjoy uh, being with the kids and, and helping being a part of uh, just teaching the kids. Uh, I could see uh, the uh, desire for the kids wanting to learn and I'm just uh, uh, thrilled to be a part of uh, teaching the kids and being a part of uh, helping them learn about Jesus Christ. Thank you.
That was his father's plan. Yeah, that's right. It was his father's plan. And he was God. And because he is God, he has power over he, anything. He didn't even want us death. to do something that he was Yes, he didn't want us to be in sin and he died for us. And he had power over death because that's how powerful he is. So I'm going to, does someone want to um, read the, today's verse from the Bible? Okay, Nicholas. Does everyone be nice? So this is from the Bible. This is what the Bible says. John 11, 25. I am the resurrection and the life. Thank you. So Jesus is saying that he's the resurrection. Um, this is a very long word. What it means is that God was able to come, that God rose again after dying. No, he lives today because he rose again. Oh, most of the words are gone. John 11, 25. I am the resurrection and the life. Should I take off some more? Yeah! Okay. <coughs> Listen up. You did a super job in this huge book last week. Finding one verse. Absolutely fantastic. So we'll practice again today before Bridget teaches us. Now, both Bibles have exactly the same words in it, but the pages are different. But that's okay. We'll do just fine. All right, so the first thing you do to find John 5, 24, is if you have this Bible, you go in three pages, and this is what the page looks like. It says on the very top, alphabetical list of Bible books. You guys ready? Yeah. Yeah. I tell you the truth. All right. I okay. Ready? I yes. Okay. Very truly I, I tell, tell you, you whoever hears my word and, and believes him who sent me has eternal life. I'm here because I love teaching these kids what I didn't know when I was younger. I wish I was their age when I received the Lord, and I didn't receive Him until about a year ago. So if I were that, if I were that age, it would have benefited me a lot, a lot to be here. And it, they're a blessing in its own. And every time you see them, you you have to be here to be them and to see what I see. And it's it's a miracle, and I love it. My hope and my prayer is that as they grow up, and maybe they won't follow the Lord right away, but as they're older and life hits them with tribulations, troubles, and all those things, that they'll remember the Bible Club and they'll remember that they have a Savior that they can go to for help and for salvation. And it's a blessing for me to watch the children when they, when it's time for Bible Club, they come running and they're excited. What I like about this club is working with the children, trying to teach them how to understand the Bible. And another thing I really like is all the people that have volunteered, they're just great to work with. I would encourage all of you to join our club and also not only that, I want to thank my pastor and my church for encouraging me to join a ministry. What I like most about the after school club is when the children come in, Miss Rosie, Miss Rosie, I know my verse, I know my verse. Do I get an extra treat? That is what I like most about the after school club kids. What I like about club is that you can just you can just um, have fun, and at the end of the day, if you get your memory verse right, you could have a snack, or you could answer some questions, and you get like let your team win. And I like club because you could just hang out there and learn about God. And what I like about the after school club is how the kids really understand what sin is. Tell them that sin is anything that you think, anything that you say, 
anything that you do that is displeasing to God. I really like how the kids understand how sin brings separation from God and that God would not allow sin to happen, that they need to have their sins forgiven. The kids really understand John 3.16, how Christ left heaven, came down to earth, went to the cross and died for their sin, for their sins, and shed his blood, and he was buried, and the third day he rose from the dead. The kids also uh, take great pride in knowing verses and finding the word of the word of God in their hearts. Hi. What I like about the club is the kids. The kids uh, just they're so special and they they just make my day. And the, and they're so enthused about learning scripture. So that's what I like. And one thing I really enjoy are the, the different kinds of kids that we have coming to the classroom and they are learning from the Word of God and that is one thing that we need to plant in their little hearts is to see. So it is such a blessing to work with these children and I look forward to having more of you joining us at one time or another. Thank you. Kim, what is it that you like about club? What do I like about club? I love that the kids choose to come. I love it when they say, can we have club every day? I love it when the parents come and visit the club and smiles are on their faces. I love that the kids invite their friends. I love it when you see the lights go on. And I love their enthusiasm. Now, co-workers, they're always looking for ways to make the club run great for the kids. And we have men in this club who, even though their, their comfort zone is other guys, they come so kids can see men who love Jesus. Did I go over? I'll have to start over.